Hello everyone! What's up? Welcome back. We are back on week ending number eight. Number eight. We are finished with week number eight. Number ocho. And current weight is 262 pounds. Ooh, getting there. So average is still about two to three pounds that I'm losing. I am happy with that. I am content as my husband eats Takis. And he just finished a huge Slim Jim. See, we shouldn't put that in there. Like, they don't even know about my Slim Jim habits. My husband is addicted to Slim Jims, Mountain Dew, and Takis. Pick my stuff. So let's explain how this all went down. Mm -hmm. So we go to Walmart. Yes, I wanted to talk about that too. I am back in the store. And unlike the last video, I did really good. It wasn't depressing. I didn't get upset. And we weren't really buying any food either. So other than wow. his Takis. But here's what happened. So this week's kind of been a hectic and crazy one. Um, Sunday was his dad's birthday. And then we went to a graduation party and partied it up. Mm -hmm. And then um, I had to go to the eye doctor and pick up my glasses, which I got them. Um, go ahead and try them on and let you guys see what I look like. Da, 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 da. Da, da. Looks like a naughty school teacher. You, you bad. <laughs> You're so dirty. So, yes, I picked up my glasses and then um, went and got my nails done. Got my pride nails. It is pride month, so I did get me some rainbow nails. They're little hibiscus flowers. Oh! All right, we are back. Welcome back. We had a catastrophe. Our camera just flew off of the tripod, and I'm not so sure that it's not going to do it again. We have had so many issues with this tripod today. Oh my gosh, but it, here we are in the middle of me talking about my hibiscus that are rainbow color for pride, and bling! I think we're okay for a minute. Yeah. You better it, hurry up, though. It come flying off. So, anyway, yes, I got my nails done. Um... And then Saturday was his sister's birthday. And then today, unfortunately, we went to a funeral. Um, a good friend of mine, her dad passed away. So we did that. So um, Walmart. So our trip to Walmart, let's kind of get back to that. Uh, it's it's kind of funny because Matt has picked up a little bit of weight. And none of his shirts want to fit him anymore. So... We went to this funeral, and he was already complaining and upset. <laughs> it's okay, babe. Um, he was already upset because, like I said, none of his stuff is fitting, and he had to end up just forcing himself into this shirt. So I'm like, we're done. We're going to go to Walmart. I'm going to pick up two shirts that fit him. I mean, he can't wear them right now for this funeral, but yeah. for any other kind of, you know, situation. Plus, all of his dress shirts that actually do fit him are on long sleeves. And it is like 90 degrees today. So Literally 90 degrees. There was no way that I knew he was going to make it in 90 degree weather in a black long sleeve shirt. So I'll die. Yeah, so that was out. So, um... This is one of the new ones that he got. I got a string here we need to cut off. Oh. I had him put it on so we could show you guys. It's kind of like a golf polo, but it's made out of that real soft kind of like silky material. So I got him this one, and um, this is a solid gray one. And then we got another one that's like black up here. And then shades into gray. Yeah, shades into to gray at the bottom. So I don't know how many would say that? Ombre. It ombres. Okay. Too great. So, um, but neither one of us have ate today because, you know, we had to get up and get things going and get ourselves ready and head out the door. Mm -hmm. And yes, I know that's bad. I should have ate because, like, right now it, we're into the evening hours and 
I've not had a protein shake either, and I should have took one of those on my way. So, so you know you make me look like a jerk sitting here eating donkeys. No, you're fine. I'm, I mean, I'm not hungry. That's what I'm that's saying. That's the point. I have to force myself to eat because I, I just don't get hungry. Um, I am staying hydrated, though. Got my handy-dandy Gatorade. I love these guys. I, we buy these every time we go to the gas station because I just love this little twist cap. Don't come after me. Um, so... We get in there, and I'm like, you know, we stop at the, the jerky because I absolutely love beef jerky. Mm -hmm. I have forever. So I'm looking at it, and I'm like, oh, you know, this little bag of uh, teriyaki nuggets. You know, I can eat the whole bag, which I wouldn't be able to now. I, I, my old day, yes, I would. I would eat that entire bag, and I would bite your hand off if you come near me. She gets vicious. Yes, I love beef jerky. And, um, so I'm looking at it, and, like, the whole bag is 200 calories. So, all of a sudden, he points out this big log of... Slim what, Jim. Yeah, Slim Jim. And, uh, I was like, do you want it? And he's like, yes, please. And then he sees the Takis, and he's like, can I get Takis, too? And I'm like, you eat Takis? He's like, yeah, it's something I picked up. I take a bite of Slim Jim, and then I eat a Taki. And I take a bite, and I eat a Taki, and I take a bite... And do it at the same time, like, bite of Slim Jim with Takis. No, just one and then the other. You'll thank me later. Yeah, so, I'm like, yes, you can. I'm, I'm not worried about that. Get you a Slim Jim and stuff. So, I did take a bite of it. Um, it wasn't a big bite, but I did take a, a big bite, or a bite of it. Uh, food. Food is going really good. Um, I've been... Eating some fish, uh, codfish. We've been baking it in our emerald, uh, what is that? Air fryer. Air fryer that does, I uh, said I don't even want to call it an air fryer because it bakes, it broils, it air fries, it, it doesn't all defrost, it warms up. It's made by emerald. My dad gave it to us as a gift. He couldn't. Thank you, by the way. Yes, he couldn't figure it out, so he's like, here, you guys take it. I don't want it. So me and Matt were like, whoop, whoop. We will take it because we were using a cheaper plastic version air fryer, and I hated that thing. Every time he would warm it up or get it going, it stunk the whole entire house up like burnt plastic or melted plastic. It was just, it was bad. Is your mouth burning? They, they, they got a little kicked on, and I might have to do and you want to hear something? My grandchild absolutely loves these. And he's just oh, a little, good. yeah, he's a little over a, a year old. Mama sent me a video the other night of him eating a taco with flaming hot sauce on it. I thought he was two. No, he was born in October. So in October, he'll be two. Another? I think. We don't even know. Yes. We're bad grandparents. I'm right. I'm right. He's not two yet. He'll be two in October. He was one in October. Okay. That's why he's not really talking. Because he's... He talks, but he doesn't. So. He's just got this thing. He's very stubborn. He does what he wants, when he wants, and that's it. Yup. One day he may say, Nana... Next day, I'll try everything I can, and that kid would just look at me and, eh, eh. So, it is what it is. So, anyway, I'm eating a lot of fish. Um, chicken sets really well with me. I can eat uh, chicken breast tenders. I will say this. I went, the day that I got my nails done, um, I was with my girlfriend, and... We decided to go to Chick-fil-A afterwards. And I thought, oh, I can get a 12-count nugget. They're only um, 200, 200 calories, isn't it what I uh, said? Something like that, yeah. Yeah, like 200 calories. I'll have to look it up. Can you have your phone? Hey, Google. How many calories is a Chick-fil-A 12-piece nugget? You didn't say grilled. 390 calories. You have to say grilled. Hey, Google. How many calories are in, in a 12-piece Chick-fil-A grilled chicken nugget? 200 calories. 200! Information I found on Fat Seeker. So, okay, goodbye. Did you say Fat Seeker? I think so. Oh, my God. That's so way Fact, not fat. Oh, I thought it said Fat, fat seeker. seeker. I'm like, oh, wow. 
So yes, so I'm thinking, okay, I'm gonna get probably a 12 count nugget. I'll probably eat about six of those, and then I'll take the other six home and I'll eat that for dinner. Yeah. Then I get up there, and I don't, for the love of me, I don't know why I did it, but I changed my mind and I ended up getting a Cobb salad with grilled chicken nuggets in it. I know why you changed your mind. Why? Because last time we went there, you ordered your grilled chicken nuggets and you got regular. Yes, and I didn't get to eat them. But, I mean, we were eating there. Yeah, it was so bad. And he, he's right. The last time I went to Chick-fil-A and I was so excited. It was going to be the very first time that I was eating out. I looked all that information up because, that again, I was with a girlfriend then. And we, you know, went and got our hair done that night. And I was so excited. I was like, okay. So I pull up to the window and I'm like, I need to get one 12 count nugget for him. And then he loves their grilled wrap with ranch. So I was getting that. And then I was like, and I need a 12 count grilled chicken nugget. So the guy's like, okay, your total's da, 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 da. So we get up to the window and the lady says, oh, I'm so sorry, but we've just sold our last grilled wrap to the car in front of you. We no longer have that. Would you like something in return? Mm -hmm. Yeah, just go ahead and give me another 12 count nugget. So I get all the way home and I'm excited and we sit down, open up the first one, regular nuggets. Here you go, babe. Open up the second one, regular nuggets. Here you go, that's it, Ooh. you know. Open up the third one and would you know it, regular nuggets. Yeah. And by this time, it's like 10 o'clock at night. I'm exhausted. I'm tired. We've been gone all day. They're and, closed. Yeah, they're closed. So Matt's furious. He's like, this is ridiculous. You're not going to be able to eat, you know, what you wanted to eat. And I'm like, it's not a big deal. That was a sign. I'm taking it as a sign. It was not meant to be. I wasn't supposed to have those nuggets. It was nuggets not meant to be that day. That day. So I'm just going to say in general because of what I'm getting ready to tell you. So, I decide I'm not going to get those regular, you know, grilled nuggets. I'm going to get a salad. My girlfriend gets a salad. Hmm, that sounds great. That's what I craved almost the whole time I was going through this process. So, I ordered a Cobb salad, like I said, grilled chicken nuggets, like I said, and I got ranch dressing. Look it all up. So, with the salad, you know, the nuggets, and that is, if you consume it all, I was looking at it like 500 and I think 80 something calories. And I'm like, okay, you know, I know I'm not going to eat all this. So, I eat a quarter of that salad. One quarter. One quarter of that salad. Get home, bust through the door, because I feel so deathly ill that I can't decide if it's going to come out the top or if it's going to come out the bottom. Mm. So, let's just say that night I got very sick. It came out both top and bottom. And I spent the very next day in bed almost all day. So, I that to me is a sign I'm definitely not ready for any kind of fast food no. So I'm I'm really glad that the nugget situation that night with you happened because that was a sign. I don't know. I think the chicken would have gone better than your salad did. I don't know, but I I feel like it would have. I agree. And you would have been so happy. Well, it is what it is. I know. All right, guys, that was how our week went. I mean, there's really nothing new. I just, I, you know, I wanted to come on and let you guys know that I'm doing a lot better with foods, foods that I am cooking, you know, foods that I am preparing. Um, oh, a ham sandwich. I did eat a ham sandwich today. Um, I ate, or not today, uh, the other day. It? Yes. Um, so I wanted to talk about that too. I had it's two pieces of white bread, bunny bread. Uh, that was right at 200 calories, uh, 120 calories. 120 calories for the two slices of white bread. Um, I did two slices of ham, and it was 32 calories each slice. And then I did one tablespoon of uh, mayonnaise, because I like mayonnaise, um, was like 110, and I didn't even use, what I did was, is I smeared it all over my bread, and then scraped off any excess, or excess, access, ex excess. Any access. Access. <laughs> um, I scraped off, you know, any of the, the what was left over. So, I, I didn't even get a, a full tablespoon. I just got a, a little bit to kind of coat the bread. 
lesson for me, and I was telling him, I ate all of it, but probably maybe two, three bites, and got pretty sick feeling. Um, there was no warning. There was no, um, you're starting to get full. Um, you didn't hit. Yeah, it, it just hit. I mean, when it hit, it was stop now, and then I felt like I was going to throw up for the next maybe hour to two hours. I wonder if that might have something to do with your celiac disease. It could, because I do have celiac, um, which means I have to eat everything that's gluten-free, and breads are very hard to find gluten-free bread. You can find them, mm -hmm. but I just used his bread, because I'm not a big bread person anyway. I, I very rarely eat bread. If I order a hamburger, a lot of times I just order the hamburger on um, a lettuce wrap. So, um, I'm thinking that, it, yeah, it, it could be that, or... Just my stomach's not ready to, because I've, I've not been eating any processed foods either. No. And ham, even though it was 67% fat-free is what it said, or less fat, mm. it is still processed. Yeah. So, it, I, yeah, maybe it's that. I don't know. But I did want to come on here and at least share all that with you. So, that is it. That was our week. That's all I have to share. So... With that being said, I want to say, as we always do, thank you for clicking on this video and watching us too. Thank you for all of your love and support. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Without you, we would not be doing this. We would not be here. So, mwah, we greatly appreciate that. Um, if you have any questions, if there's anything that you want to know, I'm starting to get people that are actually asking things or even giving me advice. I greatly appreciate it. I will respond. So leave us a question or a comment in the comment section and I will definitely respond. Don't be mean. You can be mean. I know I'm getting fat. <laughs> Man boobies. You'd be all right. We'll get you a bra. <clears throat> If you like this video, please give us a big fat thumbs up. We greatly appreciate it, and it helps our video out tremendously. You can like and share it if you want. You can tell your friends if you want. Hit that subscribe button Boom! right there. And we will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Later.